let's talk about our weather. Wow, Ooh. it cooled down. Yes. It feels good to open the windows at night. I assume both of you are happy with that. Yes, very. I'm I know. a little chilly right yeah. now. <laughs> <laughs> and no complaints coming into the weather office today. Uh, we got those cooler temperatures, and now we're even looking at the chance of some rain coming in that forecast. So let's go ahead and get you into that microclimate forecast on our Tuesday. And you can see the big headline right here, those numbers dropping. This time last week, we were talking about 110 degree plus weather. Right now in San Jose, it feels like the AC is on outside 73, Livermore at 71. As most areas also dropped from yesterday's temperatures down on average anywhere from about 5 to 12 degrees. We're going to stay with the same exact pattern from what I'm seeing right now from this cooler air that's going to be moving right across the Bay Area. And you'll see as we roll through tomorrow here, widespread fog from the North Bay to the South Bay, some spotty areas of drizzle. This is going to hang out a little bit longer than we were used to today. Even by one o'clock, we get some of that fog sticking with us in the North Bay, right around the Bay and down there towards the South Bay. So temperatures to start with that cool foggy breeze will be staying in the 50s across the Bay Area. So it doesn't really matter where you are tomorrow morning as you get the kids ready for school yourself uh, ready for work. If you're up around six or seven o'clock, definitely need some sort of a jacket 59 in the South Bay over to the East Bay. I have it at 57 and down to a chilly 54 in the North Bay. Daytime highs as we move through tomorrow stay pretty much the same as what we experienced today. So check it out in the South Bay. This is beautiful actually below average temperatures. That'll put us at 75 here in San Jose. Over to the East Bay, no more 116. Remember that 116 last week, all time record setting heat. We're at 76 here in Livermore. 73 Vallejo over to Oakland, 70. Peninsula, 64 in Half Moon Bay down to Redwood City, 73. San Francisco, it's chilly. 60 in the Marina, 67 in the Mission. And for the North Bay, 77 Santa Rosa down to Mill Valley, 70. So we have the temperatures cooling off, but the next thing that we are tracking, and it's beginning to come a little bit more into focus today, is a system that's going to be dropping down by Sunday and Monday. Now, the way things are trending today, this would move just offshore of the Bay Area, right near the coastline, so it would be able to scoop up some moisture the way things are playing out right now, which would actually give us some rain chances as we head into Sunday, also into next Monday morning. So it's actually looking decent that we could see some accumulations across the Bay Area. So you see in that seven day forecast, 60s here in San Francisco next seven days with a spotty rain chance on Sunday through the inland valley. So we go down to our chilliest day on Sunday with an average of 73. Some inland locations could even be in the upper 60s uh, once we hit Sunday's forecast. Eventually, we warm it up next Tuesday to 88. So rain totals right now for Sunday. Early estimates show a tenth to maybe a half of an inch. Oh. Yes, so things are looking up for us. We're going to have more coming up at 530. I'll get everybody a closer look at what we're seeing in those forecast models right now. We're still early out on this, mm -hmm. but this is what we need. Yeah, it's something to look forward to. Yeah. Okay, thanks, Jeff. You got it.